Okay guys, Swiss Moist, the Lani Python, Dinada Sana. You're welcome to this session. Uh, in this session, we're going to cover how you can send a mobile SMS by using Twilio. So what you actually need to have, make sure you have uh, Twilio account, okay? So if you don't have register, then after log in. After logging in, make sure you generate three things, okay? Make sure you have uh, account SSID. Make sure you have auth token and make sure you have phone number. Okay, the three will help you to send a message by using Twilio. I hope when you register for the first time, you will have a um, free trial account. Uh, we'll... Then after when your trial ends, you will actually need to purchase the service. So if you come here on Twilio, uh, send a prog programmable SMS, okay? Uh, you can see here, this is Python, SMS, C, Java, Go, PHP, and so on. For our case, we are going to use this, okay? So what I'll actually uh, do here, I'll copy from here up to here. Copy this, then after paste here. Okay, the body can be hey, hi there, or hello world, whatever. Okay, since we have, okay, loaded here, auth ID, from our created environment variable, which is this one, I'm loading, I'm loading this content from .em file with the help of decouple, okay? So I can remove this from here. And here I can put phone number, which is exactly my phone number. Okay, here I can put a phone number. So after that, let me run this Python script. And after successful uh, delivery of SMS, I'll show you the screenshot for this, okay? So let me check out uh, two, 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 two from. Okay, let me put in my, uh, okay. So here is actually pressed to put the, uh, the phone number you want to send. So I'm going to put my phone number but for the security purpose, I'll hide my number. Okay, so from for number, account SSID, and auth token are loaded from environmental variables. Now, let us run this script. Okay. Okay. I think there is some errors here. Is not a valid number. Okay, as I've told you, I'm hiding this number for security purpose. So this should be two. Right, guys. So send SMS. You can see if we are able to print SMS ISID, means that we have successful sent a message. This sum up the end of this session on how you can send mobile SMS by using Trilio in Python. So if you found out this video helpful, don't forget to like, put, comment, share, and subscribe. Your comment, your like, um, your sharing will be most appreciated. But also don't forget that in the next Tuesday we'll have a new video as normal as usual. Get a new video on every Tuesday. Let me thank you in 80 different international language. Asante sana. Thank you very much. Muchas gracias. Muito obrigado. Mexi boku. Um, 
Aita, Kamza Hamida, and Danke. Thank you. I hope to see you in my coming session. Goodbye.